Hello and welcome to Interactive CAD. Today I'm going to be showing you how to draw a spring in SOLIDWORKS. It's a very simple tutorial. So I'm going to firstly I've opened um, a blank part file and I'm going to go to the top plane and create a sketch on the top plane. This sketch is just a circle and this circle is the diameter of your spring. So I'm going to create this spring to be 20 mil in diameter. So if I exit this sketch and then I go up to features and go to curves and I want helix and spiral and I'm going to just change that to pitch of 2 mil and uh, in fact let's make it 5 mil so I've got a nice little spring there. So this is now the profile of your spring. So from there I need to draw a profile to sweep along this helix. So if you, I need to draw a profile that intersects with this point. So if I go to the right hand plane, as you can see, it's flush with the right plane. So if I go to sketch, draw a sketch on the right plane, just go normal to. And I'm gonna draw a circle, two mil in diameter. And I'm gonna make it uh, coincident with the start of the helix there. Just give it a dim of 10 mil. So if I come out of that, so now I have a path and a, and a profile. So now if I go to features, sweep, I've already got the profile sketch highlighted there, so it's asking me for a path. So if I click the helix and tick that, there you have it, a spring, a modelled spring. So that's a very just a very quick tutorial on how to model a spring in SolidWorks. I hope you found this helpful, and if you have, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, there's plenty more tutorials to come. Thanks for watching.